Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and a very good day. I'm Miss Kay and you're still with me. And today we are going to solve two problems on the topic multiplication of fractions. So let's not waste any more time. Let's view the first question. Okay, for the first question, we have 2 over 5 times 5, 3 over 4. So the first thing that we need to do is to convert the mixed numbers into improper fractions. So we just times 4 and 5 and then we plus 3. The denominator is still the same. So now we have 2 over 5 times 23 over 4. So looking at this equation, we can simplify the fractions by using the cancelling of numbers. So we can use the multiplication of 2. So we cancel the numerator 1. Uh, sorry, numerator 2 into 1 and denominator 4 into 2. So we just multiply the numerators 1 and 23 and then we multiply the denominators 5 and 2. We will have 23 over 10. So this is an improper fraction. So what we need to do is to convert this improper fractions into mixed numbers. So from, three, uh, from 23 over 10, we will have 2, 3 over 10. Okay, for question number 2, we have 1 over 2 times 1, 3 over 4. Again, 1, 3 over 4 is uh, mixed numbers, number by term 4. So we need to convert this into improper fractions using the same way, the same method. So now we will have 1 over 2 times 7 over 4. All right. Looking at this equation, we cannot use the cancelling of numbers by simplifying the fractions because there's no numbers in the same uh, uh, multiplication table. So what we need to do is to multiply the numerators 1 and 7 and then we multiply the denominators 2 and 4. So by doing this, we will have 7 over 8 as the final answer. Okay, and 7 over 8, we cannot simplify this fraction, so this is your final answer. Alright, okay, so I hope that you will understand uh, the two problems that is being shown today, and I'll see you in the next lesson. Thank you, Assalamualaikum, and goodbye!